First of all, I am not worthy. King George III. I'm backstage with Madison right now. She just won best vocal. I am with Zach and he just won best dance. I'm with the best specialty act of the night here at Night of Stars, Ellie One. I'm here with Monica and she just won best instrumental at Night of Stars. So we know that you are a songwriter. She wrote an original song for the show. I actually have eight songs out on iTunes and Spotify, um, all originals. It's been so fun to get to record those. So yeah, definitely check them out. Amazing, so how long did it take you to write these songs? It varies a lot. Uh, one of the songs on the album that I have took about a month to write, but the song that I performed tonight took probably only like two hours. Well, I've been dancing for about 10 years, and I started dancing in middle school, and then I just fell in love with it. So I'm like, eh, I guess I'll try for like the junior varsity team. Then I got into a professional company in Idaho, and you know, it just kind of escalated from there. I've been singing opera since I was about 13. Amazing. Okay, so what language was your song in? Uh, it was in French, uh, which is probably my favorite language to sing in. I love French. It definitely was beautiful. First of all, she sang and signed to How Far I'll Go from Moana. So how long have you been signing? I took a sign language class in college, and it was one course, one semester, and um, it sparked my passion for it. So I've taken some classes at a local school for the deaf um, on and off for about five years. That's amazing. So what made you decide that you wanted to sing and sign for tonight? One of the most important parts about sign language is that it adds inclusivity for all and making that environment helps our world come together even closer and I just love that aspect of it and I hope that we're able to bridge that communication gap even more because everybody deserves a little Disney. Ladies and gentlemen, I am with Ian and he just won best overall. So how did it feel when they announced your name? Every act was like, it's so amazing, like they should win. And then the next one would be like, no, they're so amazing, they should also win. So when they called my name, it was a surprise, but a very pleasant surprise. So I was going through like a bunch of different songs and this was just one I tossed around and I called my brother, listed all the songs I was thinking of and he said to do, you'll be back. That's amazing. Thank Alex Allred. Thank you, Alex Allred. All right, so where else can we find you later on this holiday season? At Candlelight Processional Choir in Epcot. That's right, ladies and gentlemen. He is in the cast choir for the Candlelight Processional. And guess what? I am too. We'll see you at Epcot.